almost here, and you know what that means. Beer, Alejandro Fontes from Santan Brewing Company is here to tell us all about Oktoberfest. Welcome. It's here. It is the end of September, and it is Oktoberfest season. Okay, so what does this mean? I know there's a big event this weekend. We're about to see some wiener dogs race, so you you do not want to miss this. They are, they are like, warming up and ready to go. I think they're getting stretched and, yeah, you know, exactly. making sure that their pre-race mechanics are in. Gotta get those hammies, That's you know, right. loose. But the festival itself is kind of our unofficial birthday party at Santan. We just just turned 17 this Congrats. year. Congrats. Thank you. Long time here in the uh, in the Phoenix area and throughout Arizona. So we throw an Oktoberfest uh, instead of our own birthday bash and we just bring out tons of good food and beer and wiener dogs to race and all kinds of fun stuff to do on Friday and Saturday. Speaking of, here are some traditional Oktoberfest foods. Of course, what would Oktoberfest be without brats and pretzels? Lame. And Lame. Not worth doing. Potato pancakes and we're going to have spetzel and schnitzel out there. Lots of good food provided by our Santa Kitchen. Spetzel Kitchen. and schnitzel would have been good names for the wiener dogs. Absolutely. But instead they're like Rufus, Gwenny, hey, and everyone forgets the There's a chance the we can one. change them. That's true. <laughs> you got the sauerkraut? That's Absolutely traditional. Absolutely handmade by Santan ourselves. Everybody knows that you guys make beer. Your beer is is delicious. It's one of my favorite things about the valley, but you also make spirits. Absolutely, and we'll have a few of those on display out at the festival. We've got our uh, Caramello Salted Caramel Whiskey, one of our <gasps> best sellers. Ooh. Our Espresso Martini and our Old Fashioned will be out there as well. And then we're also bringing breweries from in the neighborhood to come serve beer with us. Um, and they'll be providing samples just like we will before, so you can try it before you head to the bar. Tell me about the vibe. Am I going to see Lederhosen? Oh yeah, you're going to see all kinds of costumes between the Dirndl and Lederhosen hosen and the traditional garb um, people dress up for the occasion it's a it's a big community fest right and that's coming up this weekend this weekend Friday and Saturday right in the heart of downtown Chandler in the space that most people that have been there are familiar with on the east side of Arizona Avenue um, tickets are $16 now so get them now you save 20% they go up to regular price on Friday morning okay as we gear up for this race that is about to take place, okay? We have dog number one, number two, number three. And I don't know, I've never had to judge a, a, a race amongst dachshunds. Oh yeah. I'm a little nervous. We might have an Olympic style photo finish here, so we gotta be ready. One might win, right, by a nose. That's, That's it. in horse racing. That's it. Um, by the way, what's better than like a German pretzel? And pretzels these are, are in a amazing. Ball. And oh. we'll have our own pretzel balls, but there will be a pretzel vendor out there as well. Um, along with some other friends coming out to help us throw the party. Okay, now, we're gonna do this in real time, Alejandro. Oh, you're gonna help me, right? I'm ready. Okay, we we have a fantastic intern named Colby. Would you come on in and help me move this table? Of course, Aaron, always the best. We're gonna move the table behind us. Alejandro, thank you. We're gonna start our three dogs over here. Okay, Rufus, Winnie, and the other one whose name I've already forgotten. Thank you so much for doing this. Georgie! <laughs> Okay, we got Rufy, Gwenny, and Georgie, number one, number two, number three. I'm gonna come down here at the at the starting line here. Okay, you guys ready? Ready. Okay. Four, four on the floor. Ready? Okay, you ready? On your marks. Get ready? set. Go. Go. difficult but actually I feel like it was pretty obvious right number three the littlest, the littlest one. one. Oh my god come here. can I come here come here number is this which one is this one Gwenny 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 to they celebrate <laughs> they warned me it could be a little chaotic Gwenny how are you are you good with dogs Alejandro love dogs I've got a little boy at home called Kylo and we love him to death I absolutely love dogs oh, tell Kylo hi Hi, I don't know what camera we're on. Are we there? <laughs> yes. We are never in danger of overproducing this show. Never. Okay, well, I cannot thank you enough. Uh, congratulations to, to our winning wiener dog. And thank you so much for Absolutely. coming here to talk Oktoberfest. It sounds like a great event. Thank you. For more information, check out... Oh, wait, I want it. I, got, I almost had her. For more information, check out our website, cw7az.com.